I'm doing a whole lot of songs I've never done, ever, out in front of people. This is a real special one because I'm a follower of Jesus Christ. And so being a writer, I've written songs for Christ. There's a story behind this. If I can get the volume up. I am having... I think it might be a switch. I don't know. I'll try this. It's not too obnoxious, but it shouldn't be quite what it is. Hear that? Okay. It's real personal. I, my dad was a, a guy uh, who was come back from the war and he was real hard, but he was a good guy. He was a good father, a good provider, and he was loving, but he was hard too. You know, he had some racism in there and some things that he had learned and some things he struggled with, the nightmares, the coming back. He saw a lot of, he fought under Pat and saw a lot of awful, god awful things what humanity did. And I, I get the titles of my music sometimes from my dad. And this, <laughs> this has nothing to do with God. This has to do with him griping me out. He used to go, for the love of God, Netrouse. For the love of God, why didn't you do that? So, I wrote a song for God called For the Love of God. For the love of God, I have changed. I'm still me. But I am not the same. I see the world quite differently. It doesn't work the same. I'm holding the gift freely given in His name. I was taught early on you must earn what you get. You can pay or steal, but in the end there's a debt. But Jesus was so different with grace. What could I say? The day I pulled out my wallet to find he'd already paid my way. For the love of God, I So much value in me when most of my life I saw none for the love of God, for the love of God, for the love of God, for the love of God. Thank you. 